Vayeshev, the Parsha Vayeshev, the Dubna Maga said is the, from the hardest Parsha to explain. You know why? It says, you come to the Preshit, you have over here Kain and Hevel. So you know Hevel is the Tzadik, Kain and Asha. You come to Parsha Noach, you have Noach and the Doram Abu. Noach is the Tzadik, the Doram Abu is the Shem. You come to Avraham, uh, Avraham, you have Avraham, the Tzadik, and Sodom, the Rishayim. You come to Yitzchak and Ishmael, you have Yitzchak the Tzadik, Ishmael the Rasha. Yaakov and Esav, you have Yaakov the Tzadik and Esav the Rasha. But when you have Shifte Ka, you have the Shvatim, everyone is Kadosh, everyone is holy. So how do you, how do you, how do you, how do you try to explain it? So we're just going to try to explain one little thing, what's bothering me like this. Yaakov, you know, was a Nabi. Yes. I am Hashem Yaakov. I am Nabi. How did they expect to get away with it when their father is a Nabi? How did they think they can go ahead and sell Yosef and come with a, a, a his coat dipped in blood and they're going to come and bring it to him the, the, the coat of the body. Even more, how did Yaakov not see the Nebuah that it was false? That's the question. I'm asking it this way. I'm asking it. They did it in Torah. It says, It means they had a bedin. They sat down for bedin. Since it's a Hadikim, Hashem listens to Hadikim. Whatever a Hadik says, Hashem says, I agree. And they were tzaddikim, and they did a din Torah. My good friend. And Hashem has to have their back. When, when the rabbi says that someone should be healthy, Hashem listens, and he makes them healthy because the rabbi said, oh, he's right, the rabbi's right. So you're going with the, with the Mahalach that since they said, Akhul Bokh listens. And they did a din Torah. But why is it that we're still yeah, paying for the Mechirat? So listen. why are we still paying for the Mechirat Yosef? We're still paying for it. We're still paying for it. Why are we still paying with God, Yosef? And let me understand. So, 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 but Yitzchak knew. Yitzchak knew. Yeah, he says, he Aviv, Vayef Kalav Aviv, Yitzchak knew. Binyamin also knew. Only Yaakov didn't know. So how did they, they expect it? How did they expect to get away from Yaakov? <laughs> <laughs> so I, have a, I want to say Chidush like this. This is scary. Chazal tell us, Hashem Yivakesh es nefesh han yodaf. That if someone is in yodaf, even tzaddik rodef rasha, you know what that means, Albert? That means if someone is in a position and someone's out to get him, he's always out to get him. He's out to get him. So then the person that is being chased and being running after Akash Bokhu takes care of him. Even if he's a Rasha. Even if he's a Rasha. The one being chased. The being chased is a Rasha and the one who chased him is a Tzaddik. Mm. But even Tzaddik or Def Rasha, so you should always try to be the Niyadaf. But so you're saying that, other, that, 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 that any Tzaddik that, that any Tzaddik can be a Rasha at, at, some part, at some point. Right, it could happen. And that's when they chase if they chase the after Right. Not that he's a Rasha, just Hashem won't have his side. Right. Rasha will not take his side. A Sadiq could run after a Rasha. Ah. The Rasha will be helped from Hashem, and the Sadiq will not be helped in chasing this. Rasha. Correct, correct, correct. Got it. Got it. Doesn't make the Sadiq a Rasha. No, 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 of course. No, no, no. Got it, got it. Got it. So I want to say that they held that they're in your daf from yourself. And Yaakov is helping out in the Redifa by giving Yosef the Kavod with the Donat Pasim and Ben Skunim, always warning with him, and always being with him. They were always so close together. The brothers felt that they were near Daf. They both feel like they're near Daf. If you ask Yosef, he's near Daf. Why? They Why was he was near they're Daf? Chasing him. Where did they chase him? They chase him to kill him. One second, we're holding before then, before then. And until when they decide what they decide to do, they held that they were near death. He comes with his chalomot. He speaks the He meant well, but they looked at it as if they're being near death. And the cloud is, 
צדי אקריבוכי ואקש אס נפש אני דף. And they felt that their father Yaakov is part of the Redifa. Because he went ahead and Memes and Chazar of Atayna Yaakov, he went ahead and, and he treated Yosef better than he treated the others. So they felt that they were in your daf. So Hashem Yivakesh is never in your daf. So they held that they are going to be able to get away with it. Because the Abish is going to take their side. And since their plan is that Yaakov should not find out about it. So HaKadosh Baruch is going to help them make sure that he shouldn't find out about it. That's all part of the being a Nirdaf. You know what I'm saying? What we're saying is that the, the, the question is, how could it be that Yaakov is not going to find out? Yaakov is a Nabi. Yeah, but Hashem, Hashem gives you what they want to see. They can't just see anything they want. Not true. Someone's a Baruch HaKodesh, he could look at you and know all of those good things that you did. Huh. <laughs> yeah, but hadn't known that he would be able to get away with that. Who says that they should be masking? Why, he Why? Because Hashem Yavakir is Nefesh Anitav. That's what I'm saying. The Abishu was masking and they knew that, they, they, that they'd that be able to get away with it is because since HaKadosh Baruch Hu goes there to Nirdav and they were Nirdavim, like Chazal say that he went out of his way to treat Yosef better. So Memeiwa, since they were Nirdavim, HaKadosh Baruch Hu Yavakir is Nefesh Anitav and talk like you said, HaKadosh Baruch Hu listens to what the Tzadik is goes there. And Mameu, they understood that Akush Bokhna is going to be on their side and make sure they shouldn't find out. He won't find out. And he didn't find out. I mean, this is a shtikl nechama to what happened in Jersey City. You know, Jersey City is a terrible, terrible. The kids would need so much. Shabbat, they all, because the psak was that they have to bench going. Well, like kids, what, that they have to bench Hagomel. Wow. So they, they, what happened was the Menahel got all the kids together Shabbat. They stood around the Bima. He made the Birch Hagomel to be Moti them. And then they started to sing Chaz De Hashem Ki Samnu and they had a recorder. They were dancing and dancing. Chaz De Hashem Osamnu. Because they, because they, because they, they had enough ammunition to destroy that whole building. Ball of danger. danger. So what are you putting yourself in a position of danger? Yeah. Whenever you're yourself in a position of danger, you have to say the bad You have to thank the bird. Not only when you travel, you know, they say when you come back to Israel, go back and forth, but it's really for because. Well, any travel, you know. Right, but it's saying why this is life threatening situation. Because in theory, any situation that you are in a second. So you say when you're scared? No, no. no. You, you have to come to shul. You have, to, the you have right. to come to shul in front of ten people in Ben Shagum. In other words, in other words, you have to come to shul overseas, right? Then you don't. I'm saying they don't say. It's only overseas. You know, we hold them. We've been in a guy with a huge car. Yeah. I think. You have to bench Agomel? Yeah, any flight. Any flight we bench Agomel. Any flight? Any yeah, flight. For sure. Just fighting. We might be on this. And driving <laughs> also, like you said, said something like that. I know there's yeah, it's certain... It's a long drive. Well, he does. Okay. okay. But the bottom line is that the act in Jersey City shows that we are near Dafim. We are near Dafim. Near Dafim means they're after us. For sure. Oh, for sure. Yeah. And when an act comes out that they do an act after us, so it's all more that the Abishta does a shmira on us. But again, we have to understand that we believe that he is showing us. That's up to us. So we need to show that we believe that Kurdish watches over us and takes care of us. So let me tell you just a short story. The Rabbi Yonison Eifschitz, his name was, he was a governor, um, Yaris Dvash. He was very friendly with the governor of the, uh, of, the, of the city of Prague. He was in Prague, very friendly with him. So one day the governor of Prague wasn't able to sleep. So he went on to his veranda, you know what his veranda means? The porch. The veranda, yeah. And he was sitting there and he overheard the way two fellows were 
talking and they said, we have to get those Jews. We're going to get this, we're going to kill this kid and we're going to blame it on the Jews. Yeah. The kid says, the next day, the kid gets killed and the word goes out that the Jews did it. The governor tells his, the police that it's not true and tells them the it's two people that he saw. You already told no, no, I didn't know anything about it. This is just, the governor did all, the, the governor overheard. Over and the governor, and he was, and quite. So when Rennie Snipes came to meet him and thank him for what he did, he says, I got a new understanding on Hineo Yanumbo Yishan Shomer Yisrael. This is what the governor tells him. The, the translation means, Akash Bochu doesn't sleep. Akash doesn't let me sleep in order to save you. He may wa yanu wa yishan. He didn't let me sleep. He had a bark. I had to, I, I couldn't sleep. I didn't know why. I walked down onto the porch. I was the arrested. He may wa yanu wa yishan in order to share me Yisrael. He sent me out. That's what the governor said. Yeah. So, but we have to believe it. Yeah, cool. And believe that the boy and watch is over us. What? Right. That's what we have to believe. That's all I have to believe. And what does it mean in English? That means in English is that night the king couldn't, king couldn't sleep. Be a show me should never happen again. I'd be as loyal tzedek. Such a tragedy. Amen. Amen.